My guiding adventure started as a spark when I was only five years old, with my mom as one of the leaders. Even at that age, I knew that I wanted guiding to be a part of my life forever. The experience unlocked so many doors, like learning to camp, becoming more outgoing, and making new friends. As soon as I advanced from Sparks, I moved on to Brownies, where I had a blast trying new things. After my second year, my family moved overseas to Sweden. Luckily, my school offered a British Brownie program, and I continued to earn badges there. After moving back to Canada, I resumed my guiding career as a second-year guide. In just two years, I was able to be a patrol second and a patrol leader. I also earned my Lady Bain Powell Award, which is the highest accomplishment you can get as a guide. Fast forward a few years, and here I am now, finishing my third year of Pathfinders. I still love attending our weekly meetings, and I always look forward to camps and sleepovers. Some of my best friends are in my Pathfinder unit, and I highly doubt they would have come into my life if we didn't share the sisterhood of guiding. Where am I now because of guiding? I am part of the Ontario Girl Forum, which consists of 11 elected youth members. We provide girl input on the provincial level, and we have a blast doing it. I have also traveled nationally. In the summer of 2016, I camped for nine days at Guiding Mosaic in Alberta. I am currently making plans for international travel in a few years. Finally, guiding has inspired me to be the change I want to see in this world. Therefore, I decided to travel to Nicaragua in the summer of 2017 and volunteer in a community struck by poverty. My name is Shannon Wallace, and that's my guiding story.